Good evening, Jules fans, and welcome back to another match day live from Jules and Blood TV. Myself and Boz currently sat in front row of the Rainer Men watching the boys warm up for Gillingham versus Harrogate Town. First ever meeting. Um, Saturday. We didn't go. Probably the best decision. Wasn't very good. No, I said to you, personally, I thought all the goals were preventable. Mm. Oh, yeah, so, so, so preventable. Yeah, let's, let's, that'll do for the analysis of Saturday. It's been in Donna as long as we learn. Uh, team moves for tonight, a couple of changes. Team in full, Glenn Morris in goal. Uh, back four, Will Wright, uh, Elkham Baggett, Maxima, and Ryan Law. There's a couple of changes uh, further forward. No Sean Williams tonight, not in the 18 at all. Don't know if that's an injury or whether he's just being rested. So it's Stuart O'Keefe returning to the 11 next to Ollie Lee. Further forward, it's a debut on the left. It looks like the happy Adela Coon. Looks like Ben Reeves in the 10. Jordan Green uh, from the right hand side and Big Lee Commander on up top. Uh, we do have Matty McArthur, youngster, on the bench. Along one with. Hell of a um, it is a very good haircut. Uh, very Australian. Who is the rest of the bench? Jack Turner, David Tatonda, Shay Alexander, Scotty Cashkit, Lewis, Lewis Walker. Walker, and Alex McDonald. In terms of Harrogate, um, and, and I mean no disrespect to them, I don't know a lot about their team. No, uh, no, the only one I really know is their captain, Josh Falcon, but he's not in the squad, it doesn't look like, so I don't no, know whether he's injured. I remember John Stead being there a couple of yeah. seasons ago. No, Mark Oxley, the Yes, that's probably one of the ones South that stands Bay. out from South End was at Carlisle. There was one um, more John that Matt, we noticed, Matt, yeah. Matt. And I think was the, um, there was another one I said that came from Colchester. Uh, oh, uh, well, that was it, yes, I think they signed him in the summer. But um, that dreaded question, uh, trying to get Saturday out of the system, uh, what do you think in terms of the score prediction? Um, I will take an early 2-1, just to get confidence back out of it. When was the last time we scored two goals at home? In a win, more from last year. Like so we, we, we wrote the wrongs of, um, we righted the wrongs of not winning at home on a Saturday last time out, so I'm going to say 2-0 to Jules. I think we, at home this season we have to be attack minded and also with our threat record we have to try to defend which is great. We need to be attack minded in this league. We've got to believe that we can, now we've got two wide players. Uh, I'm looking on Saturday, Green was probably the only shining light for me, but it's really good. Um, but yeah, two wide players hopefully. Big man in the middle, that swing two for you, right? So let's do it. Let's go for it. Yeah, lots of pace as well. Absolutely. We've got, but the problem for me is that we need to have the same attitude away from home as we do at home. Yeah, that's how, the thing. We've got to stay yeah. in games. Let's playing. see how that pans out as the season goes on. So we'll forget about Saturday. Um, cost a pretty packet for whatever reason. But let's just put that behind us. It was game three. There's a long way to go yet. And let's hope we've learned from that experience. Score prediction. I reckon 2-0 Jules tonight. I've said 2-0. I think Bosley said 2-1. Yeah. Enjoy yeah. it, mate. Thanks, brother. Joined now quickly by Tom ahead of the game. Um, looking forward to it. Good Very chance so, to get yeah. Saturday out of the system. Yes, yeah, forget about it. Move on. Home crowd, home home bikes. New signing, yeah. starting, yeah. positive, right. lots of pace. Yeah. Uh, the only one, obviously, Sean Williams. Rested or injured, I'm not sure. No one's announced anything. Well, we obviously know that Gorkin and Knott is 30, 35. Yeah, right, yeah. So, maybe we'll wait play if we play every game, but be out completely. Is, is I think it's a case of though we had to pick one to miss either tonight or Walsall and he probably thinks that Walsall no disrespect yeah. to Harrogate is a bigger test. But also he might he might think uh it's fair to say it's done for attacking for that he's gone to the front foot, yeah. So why not? Harrogate are the best team in the world and well, score right. prediction. Two one. Two one Harrogate. 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 So you said 2-1, Boz has said 2-1, myself yeah. and Glenn said 2-0. Fair enough. Enjoy the game. Yeah. Two extra special guests tonight. We've got Jacob and Joey on the channel going to give us their score predictions. Boys, we're going to win. Yeah. What's the score going to be? 2-1. 2-1 to Fields. We're going to win. 3-1. That deserves a high five. I like that. Enjoy the game.
Actually, it was really pissed off. It was definitely a goal kick, though, when it bounced on Jordan Green's knee, but we'll take it. Fingers crossed we're going to make something happen. It's going to be Will White out, so we're right back taking all the set pieces. Drilling, where's it gone? Get up, Mika! It's good defending. We're throwing on the far side. This is really good, though, for Ben Reed just to get there. Oh. Get there. Target was it? Oh. Coon's first touch of it. He's done really well. Oh. Ben, give it to him. Oh. 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 Yes! Oh. Oh. Eleven gone, boss. Uh, first sign of the in terms of the visit. Got an easy overload. This side didn't they? Uh, throw him. And uh, Morris had to make a piece and save, yeah. Should be a corner to the away side. Uh, I think Ollie Lee got away with that because I thought he might have been booked for that challenge. Uh, yeah, 11 gone. Jill's still in the ascendancy, but Narragate just uh, warning us that they're in the game. Kuhn can't adjust his body shape, unfortunately. Jill's back on top, 21 minutes play. Come on, Jill! We trail, boss. Come on, Jill! Yeah, it is. They're getting down the, their left again, don't they? It's a good ball back, and Matty Daly has just come out on the announcement. He's slide it in from the six yards out. It's against the run of play. There's no dispute in that, but... Unfortunately, us not taking our chances against coming back to us. Work to do, 25 play. Ball for Jules in late minutes to play, but we kept it for ages, didn't we? And it worked the angle really well, which was good. People moaning, and then if we go long, they're moaning, we go to early. Get him! Oh, good defender again. Just won't fall for us in their six yard box. Yeah, yeah, it's quite open, isn't it? Oh, it's massive save. Glenn Norris, yeah. We got caught with it, didn't we? He's around through on goal. Morris stood up. Keeps us at 1-0. We are on top, though, aren't we? That's the thing. It's a strange game, actually. We're almost dominating. Yeah, we've probably had 60% ball, yeah. Just hasn't quite fallen for us in the six-yard box. But, yeah, we're still six minutes to play. Still on top in general play. What a fucking good I'm here at the Breeze Field and I'm joined by Scotty. Um, it's been a better side on the whole, haven't we? Much about our boss position. Yeah. Like a punch. It's been a bit of a weird game. Paul's made a very good point just a minute ago where he said, probably up until the goal, we were a better team. Yep. Started off really brightly. Um, and yeah, we missed some field edge chances. Jordan Green made a decent save, but he's a few yards out. You'd expect him to score that. And then about a minute or two later, uh, brilliant ball from Will White. Right. Back to the post. 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 We're creating plenty. I, I still think there's an over reliance sometimes to hit the long ball to manager on them. I think teams already know what they're doing. They kind of both centre backs kind of seem to stick on him and make makes uh, manager's job more difficult. But um, Harrogate was a threat as well to be fair. They obviously they've got a goal but they could have had another one. Clint Morris made a big save, didn't he? Just one yeah, on one so we got caught by a caught in possession. It's been a bit of a weird one, that's one nil Harrogate, but I mean it could be any variety of scores, I think both fans you wouldn't have complaints if it was like one nil to us, two one to us, or Arabic fans could say they could argue the point that they should be the so biggest frustration again is like a lot of the games this season, we've had our spell, not taken our chances, and then we've allowed a fairly soft goal to go in at the other end. Yeah, very much. I mean, with that, I'd be interested to watch it back. It looked like a foul in the build up, but Nandra was certainly unhappy with the goal. But yeah, uh, again, it, regardless of that, it was too easy for them. Day, We've got to be brave now, though. We've got to keep playing the way we have been, rather than re reverting to that long ball too much, like you said. And we have to be fair. We've created chances since the goal. Yeah, I mean, when we get the ball in down wide and putting crosses across the box, that's when we look most dangerous. And we just need one of them to hit someone and go in. It's just as simple as that. That's, that's the luck you need at times. We're creating the opportunities. We're getting the ball that wide. And Jordan Green, you know, has got one toast. Ben Reeves. Um, again, brilliant. He's trickery on the ball. He's, um, you know, he sold their defender a dummy. He took two out of the game at one point, flashed the ball across, and again, it just needs someone to touch, touch it in, touch it in. So, yeah, for summer, the better side. Just what need one to go in. We might go on and win it. Started off 
start the first half. Corbin, of course. It's a good one. Back attack. It's just ended it over again. That's the second half chance he's had. Yeah, he has, yeah. Just got it on the way down again. Drills to the uh, team all down, boss. That was one of the worst misses I've seen in a long time. Six yards out, seven yards out. It's the whole goal line, man. He's put it out for a throw in nearly. Will Wright's been put. Maxine was furious. All comes because people didn't want to come free. Big 40 minutes instead. Then Morris to save you again. They get through one on one on the left. He makes one save, gets up, manages to tackle the fella as well. They could be freeing it up, couldn't they? Any changes in the No, nothing. 58 dollars. And he's running away from goal. Two changes. Looks like a change of shape. 4 4 2. Yeah, we've got a central midfield pairing of uh, Reeves and Lee at the moment. Green switch to the left and the Delacoon to the right as well. 24 to play. At the moment, you said that earlier, didn't you? Delivery has to be good. Can't say we ain't got any targets today, mate. Guns, Ben Reeves, where's that gone? Oh, it's all defending. Lee, come on. It's great defending, to be fair. Really good block. Missed the target. Sums us up, unfortunately. Game over, boss. 2 0. Um, it looks out ball, but we then let him dance for our penalty there and smack it in. Glenn Morris does his best to keep it out again. We've been a ball in this second half. Predictable, blunt. Seeds off goals. No urgency, no desire. No, 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 he scored one league game since the past season, and then Morris, what was he, 35? 38. Yeah, and if it weren't for him tonight, it's going to be three or four. We've been shocking second half. First half, we were bright. We tried to make things happen. We just rolled over this second period. About four minutes of injury time left. 